glasses off, glasses on, glasses off, glasses on. <clears throat> Hi guys, it's Nick here and I'm sorry about the noise. Um, I've got to have the window open because it is ridiculously warm in here and um, yeah, so and just as I decide to start filming, every single car in where I live seems to want to drive past my bedroom window. Anyway, as you may guess, today's video is a little Q&A video about my glasses and my eyesight after one of my subscribers, Lean On Me, got in touch and sent me a message asking me if I would mind doing a video on the topic, answering um, some questions that they sent. I'm not being paid to do this video, I should probably mention that too. Um, so let's get started. Before I answer any of the questions that Lean On Me asked me, I thought I would also mention that one of the, well, the reason that my eyesight is bad is because um, I was born so early, I was born premature, uh, premature, I was born 14 weeks early, and when I was born, my retinas are, instead of being normal retina shaped, they're sort of rugby ball shaped. Uh, I think one of them is dragged and one of them is scarred and dragged as well, so they're slightly um, a different shape, I think, to a normal retina shape. There is a name for it, no idea what it is. I went to see an optician about two years ago and the optician looked at me and she said, Ah, you're the first adult I've taught with, I've, I've tried with blah 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 blah, and I went, what? And she said, Oh, you're the first adult that I've tried with blah 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 blah, and I was like, Ah! Is that that thing with my retinas? And she was like, yeah. So, um, yeah, so, um, also, I've had glasses. Um, I think my mum said I was about two when I got my first pair of glasses, although I don't actually remember ever not having glasses. I do remember being under a specialist for a long time because I'm almost blind in my right eye, um, or I have very little vision in it, um, at all I had to wear eye patches to make it stronger when I was younger and I don't know if you can tell you can if I lean in close that I actually have a lazy eye which is my right eye so it's good to know that I um it's really distracting watching my own lazy eye hmm anyway back to the questions so the first question that lean on me asked was are you near or far sighted and I'm actually short sighted which means I can see things that are near to me but um I think someone's cutting their grass now apologies if you can hear that so yeah I can see things that are near to me without my glasses but I can't see um things that are far away without my glasses uh lean on me also asked what my prescription was and the absolute honest answer is that I have absolutely no idea. I know that my lenses are usually quite thick. I don't know if you can see this because I can't actually see what you see right now. Um, but my lenses are quite thick. Um, I have to get them thinned down because they're, they're quite thick because my eyes are quite bad. So, um, yeah, my prescription is my eyesight is, is bad, really bad without my glasses. Uh, which is, funnily enough, Lean On Me asked how far I could see without my glasses. So... I don't know this in terms of distance and measurement, but if I tell you I am filming this on my laptop, just sat on my at my desk on a chair quite close to my laptop, my face is blurry, like, I can't tell what colour my eyes are, I mean obviously I know that they're brown because they're my eyes, but I would know they were dark, but I wouldn't know what colour they were if I didn't know what colour my own eyes were can just about make out my eyebrows although they just look like a fuzzy sort of blob of color they are separate to my eyes but they're all sort of merging into one so i suppose um i can make out like looking at the laptop screen i can make out like the wardrobe behind me um i know there's stuff on there but i wouldn't know that it was a stack of teddy bears oh actually i probably would yeah i would know that they were teddy bears um, um, so yeah, I couldn't tell what teddy bears were up there. Uh, I can probably tell that there is a panda up there, just because I can see some blobs of black and white. But other than that, I couldn't tell you which of my teddy bears are up there if I didn't know already. If that answers that question. Um, one of the other questions that Lean On Me asked was, could I try reading a couple of sentences 
at my book without my glasses on. So I'm just grabbing the nearest book to hand, which is The Dangerous Game by Mari Jungastetti. It'll be backwards to you, I'm guessing. But she's, uh, well, this author is Swedish, so apologies if I get the name wrong. I'm not Swedish and I'm not very, you know, I don't speak Swedish. So it just happened. I picked it because it's the book I'm planning on reading next and uh, I haven't started it yet but looking at it the text is quite small so this is going to be quite interesting let's have a look okay so oh oh I don't like this it was a warm day in May and she was strolling alone through the streets of Milan after a while she came to a large paved piazza in front of a church so that's me reading as you can see my eyes are very close um, to the book and I wouldn't be able to do this very for very long uh, before my eyes started hurting and I got a terrible headache so I'm going to put my glasses back on for a little second and give my eyes a rest before I answer the next few questions. So I think the final question that Lean On Me asked was can I describe certain objects in my room without my glasses on and the answer is I'm going to try and one of the things I'm going to pick because I've just seen it is my little panda ornament I this panda is slightly tinged yellow he was when I got him as a present from my mum and my stepdad I'm not entirely sure why I, I don't I don't know but I call him Mr Periwinkle Panda so um yeah so I'll have a go at describing him so if I sit him on the palm of my hand, about here, I can tell that he's a panda quite quite clearly. Um, I can make out the yellow and the black and well, his eyes and his ears sort of look a bit fuzzy, as do if you can see where I'm holding my hand here, my own fingers um, look a little fuzzy. I'm looking at the bottom of him, I can see he's got some green, uh, I don't know what you'd call them, sort of green bits to sit him on like standy bits so that it doesn't slip around and there is a white label on the bottom I think the text is blue um, or text I think it's text it might be a picture can't read it no idea at all what it says um, so yeah that's that I need to pick another object let's choose something a little bigger. Let's choose my hippo full of note paper. As you can see, I think they're all just blank notes inside, but it's quite handy to have around. So if I hold him away from me, uh, I can see him quite clearly. He's got his little nostril and his mouth. Um, I can see that he's got metal and so yeah, I can see him. If I put him a little bit further away from me this is really hard because I if I hold up and I look at him in the webcam I've absolutely because I'm trying to pick things that are quite far away but you guys can still see the distance that I'm looking at him from but if I hold him up rather than here in front of my face if I move him up to here and look at him in the laptop screen I have no idea what he is I mean I can tell he's blue and he looks a vaguely odd shape can't see the paper unless I turn it towards the lights if it's there I can't make out that he has paper in it I don't know if you guys can I won't know till I watch this back he has a silver bit on his mouth somewhere here um, can't see that at all I'm just telling you that from memory um, if I squint I can see that he's got ears um, yeah that's about it really so I hope this video was everything that lean on me uh, wanted to see. Um, thank you so much for requesting um, a video. If any of you have any ideas or suggestions for a video then please don't hesitate to get in touch at any of the links below um, and if I, or leave me a comment and if I feel that it's appropriate and that it's something that I would quite enjoy doing I would be quite happy um, to, to make those. I'm going to go now and cut this video short because all this stuff without my glasses on is actually giving me a bit of a headache um, because I'm that short-sighted that I really can't cope without my glasses for very long. So uh, if you want to see a video of me losing my glasses, I'll pop a, 
a YouTube card or you know a link or something up there for a day when I not only tried to do my eyeliner but you know totally failed so go check that out because obviously I can't have my glasses on when I'm doing my eyeliner and I do lose my glasses and I have to put on my old glasses to find my new ones uh, if you like the video then please give it a thumbs up press the like button uh, hit subscribe if you want to see some more videos and I'll see you again soon bye guys